guys, what's up? It's me, and this is the premiere of Nomad of Nowhere. So, um, I'm watching this late. Um, I was out of commission and not really doing videos for a little while, and this came out during that period. It came out, um, during my flight back home for spring break, and then I wasn't able to watch it over spring break. So I'm watching it now, and I'm really excited because I love, I love deserty shows, because I'm from the desert, and it also gives me an advantage when I do cosplay stuff, because normally it's like, oh crap, I have to go find a forest in the desert, that's fun. But no, now I just have to find a desert within the desert, which is very easy to do, because it's a desert. I just said the word desert a lot. Uh, that doesn't feel like a word anymore. <laughs> so this is episode one of Nomad of Nowhere. I'm very excited. I saw the picture of Scout, um, and I love her, and I love her design, and I'm gay, and I love her, <laughs> and I want to cosplay her, and I want to see how this goes, and the Nomad just looks really cute. Alright, let's do this. Ugh. That was not a bird I'm used to. Cacti! Time to die. Oh wait, so this two-headed armadillo. I wasn't sure if it was like two armadillos on one, but that is a two-headed armadillo. That is... Her! Who is she? Who is she? I love her. I saw her on the banner for the show, and I love her. And who... What is it you're doing back there? Just take an inventory, Todd. Got everything we need to catch a bounty. Knife, jerky, bow, arrows, quiver, knife, Don Paragon special agua elegante, more knives. Uh, Todd? Why do we need so many knives again? Stabby. I feel called out. Even this one? Yes. Especially that one. Oh, right. How silly of me. Why do we need so many books? Uh, so that we'll know everything we need to know about the wilderness? I already know everything I need to Don't know throw about it. the wilderness. Oh, of course. I'm such a dunderhead. Such a dunderhead. Mm. I love her. Be gone, thought. You are here because you are the finest soldiers in any of the four corners. You are ruthless, cunning, and your name strikes fear into the hearts of all who would oppose us. You are Dawn Paragon's dandelions. The Dawn chose each and every one of you for this important mission to find the dreaded nomad. Does she speak Some in of you may third die, person? But so many more will return back to the oasis as heroes. You said all this last time. And the time before that, at the cave? You were so sure he was in that cave. But he weren't. And I'll say it as many more or times not. as I have. So to she's not we find him. Dawn Paragon. The Nomad isn't just another bounty. He's the most wanted man in the world and has been for the last hundred years because he's magic. He's a menace. That a menace that must be stopped. We know you done told us. It's like she don't even listen to us, Jethro. Well, I for one. Go. Does anyone else have something to say? Same. Well, since you invited Was he there the whole time? It's clear you're leading us on another wild goose chase. And when you return to Don Paragon empty-handed again, Red Manuel will be the one to take your place at his side. Well, looks as though Red wants to start this old song and dance at the top of the mission today. Scout, get me my stabbing knife. Now hold on, you two Which are one? supposed to be on the same side. And we're supposed it's... to recognize rank. Toth's in charge because she's the best and everyone knows it. Toth? How adorable that your spittoon girl thinks so highly of you, Toth. Hey now, in addition to carrying the spittoon, I'll have you know I also carry a great deal of other things. Same. And how's that working out for you? <laughs> She's doing her best. <laughs> <laughs> it seems she can handle it better than you. True. Now they're dating. I'm sorry, I don't make the rules, but they're dating. Do not leave. Well, I 
I've never seen flour like this in person. Don't touch it. Some of these plants shouldn't even exist anymore. You think a book is going to protect you here? <laughs> that book could have told you that was a poisonous pinch buddler. You think being clever means you belong here? But we all oh, know God, the sound effect comes to take action. You'll just cower behind thought like you always do. Hmm. I'll show that red what's what. I am cut out for adventure. I am brave. Ah! Oh no. Great job, Scale. You've gone and difficulted this whole thing up. Difficulted? It's a rock. Oh, now I'm just scaring myself to think that. No, it's not. Would. They're so cute. <laughs> Whomst? Knife? more intimidating for a second yes that answers that my the squeaky name is noise reckon you live out here in these brambles great maybe you can help me out got a name stranger mm. you Aww. can talk can't you no a mute, huh? well that's a conundrum I don't even know what to call you Spell it out, spell it out, spell it out. You want me to call you friend? Aww. Well, that's good enough for me. Uh, say there, friend. These critters are amazing. Are, are they just part of the local wildlife here? Or... Hey! Well, dang nabbit. Huh? What in the... There's nothing quite like this in my field guide. I wonder if maybe the nomad is here. And this is all the result of his magic. I have to go, friend. I've got to find Toth. Wait, you know the nomad? You know where he lives? Can you show me? Oh, thank you. This will show every single oh, one. Just a friend. Even Toth will have to notice. Let's go. Why are you leaving? He needs to leave. I love the Nomad. I love them. <laughs> Ripper books. The knowledge hippo. What is this place? Huh. Looks like nobody's home. <laughs> hey! This feels an awful lot like trespassing. You coming in? Must have been cooped up in here for ages. They say nobody's seen him for a hundred years. Aww. Does he ever leave the briar patch? Aww. Seems like it'd be awful lonesome. Aww. He must be dying for someone to talk to. Yeah. No wonder why he's so evil. Well, the nomad clearly lives here, so I think it's best we set up an ambush and wait for him to come back. I'll go get Toth and the others. Oh, you're gonna love her. Once she finds that evil nomad, she'll really let him have it. Hmm. Is something wrong? Yes. Can you write it out? What are you doing with that old sheet? PowerPoint.
coming with us. And no amount of trickery and magic can save you. Sentient knives. You fools. Red Manuel will show you how this is done. Get back here! You're ruining Red Manuel's moment! Ah, shit! No more games. Toss, wait! He's not what you think! <laughs> I can't see! Quick, help Red Manuel! He's claustrophobic! Though much too proud to admit it! <laughs> Get your hands off me! <laughs> Burn to death. Not catching fire. Um, sorry. Let him get away. Same. He's not out of the woods yet. So let's burn the woods down. Jesus! Toss, don't you think that's going too far? Uh, these moral quandaries are beyond our pay grade. I concur. Oh, oh dear. die. Us. Her flowers burn. Friend. Mm. <laughs> You've got no place to hide, Nomad. Don Paragon will hear of what happened. He will not rest until you are captured. So, what are you going to do now? <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Okay, toss. I really like that. I really like that. That was different from what I was expecting. I don't know what I was expecting, but that wasn't it. But I really, really like that. I love the Nomad. I love him. I really want to come with him now. Just buy a black morph. Just the, just his eyes. Just oh god. If they don't sell like, like, uh, I don't like to bring up 
what I really like was a webcomic, but it just it, it reminds me of the mayor from Homestuck. And just the really big expressive eyes and not being able to speak and I just want to- I want to love him! I want to give him a hug and hot chocolate and sit him down in like... A home with friends! I want him to be loved and happy! I love him! I, I love him! I love how this- I like this show. I really like this show. It's not what I was expecting. I wasn't expecting Toth to be a thing. Uh, I saw her in the banner when I clicked on the show page and I was like, oh, who is that? I like her! And now I'm like, mm, I don't like her. Like, dude, I agree. Knives are cool. As someone who has several knives. They're cool. But that's a lot. Also, tag yourself in the sentient knives. And I love the rocks. And that was so cute. What the hell? That was so pure. That was so pure. And I love the nomad. And I want him to be happy. And that's literally the only thing I can think of after all that. It's just, I want the nomad to be happy. I would die for this man. Why are you glaring at me? You know I'm right. My cat's glaring at me. But I want him to be happy. And I want him and Scout to be best friends. And I love Scout. She's a sweetheart and she's doing her best and she's trying really hard. And I love her and I hope good things come to her in the end. And I love the show and I'm gonna go watch episode two right now because I really need to watch it. So I will see you guys next week and this will hopefully be on time after this. But we'll find out, so.